think? Get out! Firing the cannon! Where Fire! is he? Where is he? Left side! Left side! <laughs> I knew the guys had no idea how bad our house's security was, but they just didn't understand. All my ideas for upgrading security, they laughed at. But now, I'm gonna show them how much we need that security. Oh, hey, Jake! Wait, what's that, Jake? prove to you guys that we do not have good enough defenses in this house. Why would you shoot Phil like that? Yeah, well, he was the first person I saw. If it was you, I would've shot you. What do you mean? We don't have enough security, Jake. We literally have a secret bunker. Yes, Logan, we have a secret bunker. We have a nerf room, but that is not enough. I've told you time and time again, we need a nerf tank. Okay, everybody else has a tank. And if we are gonna defend this house, we need, yeah, you guessed it, a tank. Now, I've been working on a project for a little while, and I need you guys to see this. Jake, there, there's nothing there. Exactly, because I'm going to draw it before your eyes. We built a lot of box forts, boys. We built a lot of box forts, and they've been some great box forts. Some would say Papa Jake's the box fort king. Do I call myself the king? Yeah, I do. But what we need to build is a box fort nerf tank. Now, what I want to do is create a two-story box fort with working side turrets. I'm, I'm not very good at drawing. I'm, I'm good at building box forts, not drawing, okay? A front-facing cannon, a up-top turret that we can fire out of, back turrets, front turrets, sky turrets, every type of defense you can think of. This thing needs to be double layered in cardboard, impenetrable, so when someone comes in this house and tries to break in, they're going through this and not that. Ayo, hey, what is going on everyone? It's Papa Jake and welcome back to a brand new video. And today guys, we are going to be making the ultimate, the biggest box fort tank ever built. It, it makes no sense to build a box fort tank at the top story of our house. Actually Logan, it makes a lot of sense because if an intruder comes into your house, where are you gonna run? You're gonna run upstairs to this room, get in the tank, and when they come in and they see a box fort tank, they're running the other way nine times out of 10. You can't go anywhere. Once you're in the tank, you can't move. You don't need to go anywhere, it's a tank, Logan. Unless they bring a tank, but I highly doubt they're bringing a tank. So it's pretty simple what we're gonna do for this, guys. We are gonna be using some tables to elevate it, and then we are going to create it on the second story and add a ton of electronics, a ton of Nerf blasters, and just lots of really fun stuff to make this tank as real and as cool as possible. We haven't done a box fort in a while, so again, if you guys like us building box forts, I know you guys love us building box forts, comment down below what we should build next, but let's get building this thing. Okay guys, so as you can see, we have been working on the base of the tank and it's not really much so far, but it's getting there. We're gonna have tracks on the side of it and basically we're gonna be elevated up here. So this will be the front where we sit. We'll have like a viewpoint coming out of here. And then over on the sides here, we're gonna have two different turret systems, probably have a way to get in the back through here. And then in the middle, we're going to have a raised section where you'll actually have like the tank's big cannon that'll shoot out there. So what I'm gonna work on right now, while Logan continues on the build is actually getting the tank's cannon ready. And to do that, I'm gonna be using one of our mortar systems. Now, I'm gonna have to rejig this whole thing so it actually works like a tank firing device, but if I get this thing down, it'll be super cool because we can fire a bunch of these mortars out the front of the tank and it'll actually work like a real tank. Plus, we also have to work on getting the nerf blasters that we're gonna use in here, and there's a lot to do, so let's start this first. All right, guys, so if you've never seen how this works before, I'll show you right now. It's super cool. So basically, you have your mortars here, which you prime in this thing like that, and then the mortar is primed. Then we have our mortar blaster here. Drop this in the top, and then you can fire at Logan. Hey, Logan, mortar out! Woo! Hey, got it. 
So pretty cool, but we need to completely modify this system and maybe amp up the power a little bit so we can fire straight out of a tank cannon. Don't know how I'm gonna do that yet, but I'm working on it. Okay, so we got the tank's wheels on. Uh, I think it's called the tank track. It's looking pretty good. We're not done yet, but all together, I think this looks super sick. It's starting to look like a real tank. Okay, so we got our second box fort tank track going. Just gonna slide it in right here. Almost done the second one. The first one is looking awesome. But Jake has been here. I'm working on a tank cannon, all right? It's almost there. I almost have it down. I just can't fully figure it out. Jake, yet. Jake, tell the Papa Jake squad what's going through your head because I've been hearing a lot of complaining. I'm trying to get this thing to launch out of the tank cannon. I've went from the original orders. They weren't powerful enough. So now we're using CO2 power. Basically, you put it like this. I don't think that's supposed to happen. I'm working on it. Box for tank is starting to look like a tank. If you're enjoying this, smack that like button. All right guys, so check it out. We've been working on the tank and this thing, I know I always say it, it's gotta be one of the sickest builds we've ever done. Look at it! It's a tank! It actually does look like a fully functioning tank, Jake. Now guys, we haven't finished the inside. There's still a lot we have to do. Obviously, this is gonna be able to move and fire stuff out of it. We even have a turret at the back there where we can blast enemies with nerf darts, but there is still a lot we're gonna add to this thing. Most of it's gonna be in the interior, and once it's done, we are gonna put our tank against the one, the only, Philip. If you come around the side, here's the entrance Woo! to the tank. Jake, why is there a vacuum back here? Uh, well, I was working on some methods to fire the uh, darts out the front. And yeah, you were, you were doing that for like an hour, Jake. Yeah, uh, there was a lot of tests that were done. And, and what happened, Jake? Uh, a lot of the tests failed. That's because Logan did not hire me a team of engineers as I asked for in the start of this video. So uh, we had to resort to some other methods to fire the darts, but that is okay because we have our massive tank shells along with some mini tank shells that we can bam fire right out the cannon. All right, let's check out the inside of the tank. All right, come inside check the tank. Check it out, oh. guys. This is so cool. So we've got the tank set up where we have two different uh, like driving stations. One's here and one is on that side. In the middle, this is going to be the firing station where you can fire the main cannon. I realize that you have no way to look out and see what you're firing at, so that might be an issue. Over here, we've got room for supplies. We can put any of our army gear or extra ammunition. Obviously, this would be my or low Logan's driving station. Back here we have the turret seat, which does a full 360. Once you get up here, you can look out, any enemies coming. We got this swivelly chair, so you can do like a full 180 view of anyone who's outside. Hey Logan! I'm probably gonna mount this up here. Oh! That's right, Jake. Yeah, don't mess with the tank. Yeah, this is, uh... This is pretty sweet. The only thing that I don't understand, Jake, this tank doesn't move. It's like a sitting duck. It does, with your imagination. And the power of editing. <laughs> editing, yeah. All right, so the tank is almost complete. Been working on a couple of upgrades. Now when you close the door, we have a locking system in place. And the door is locked for security. I don't know what this room is called, but this is where we load the missiles into the cannon. Take our missile, put it in. Then with the radio system, Jake will be on the top turret and he'll let us know the coordinates of wherever we need to blast this thing. Over here, we have a side turret. Okay, the tank is fully ready to go. Jake, we're ready to defend this house with the tank. Do you know how to drive a tank, Logan? This won't. This won't drive. As we just saw in the previous clips, it does drive. But yes, let's get into the drive. Ah! Bill, Bill! What are you doing? I'm gonna get into this tank, guys! Show Jake that he was wrong for shooting me earlier! Oh my gosh. Okay, we are inside the tank. Jake! Well, again, I've got a 360 view. I'm keeping him at the door, but I can't keep him there for long. All right, Logan coordinates are X, 
seven. That's all your coordinates. Just say like to your left. Oh, okay. To your left, Logan. He's at the door. Fire the missiles. Okay, firing the missiles. Yeah. Right side, Logan. He's on our right side. Okay, I'm getting the I cannon. Don't want ammo. I'm pressing no. him back. Firing the cannon. Where is he? Where is he? Left side. Left side. <laughs> Hit it beside him, but we're taking heavy fire up here, Logan. Should I blast another one? It's not cupcakes and bunnies up here. It's real man's work. Yes, fire one hard left, hard left. Guys, I can't get on. Well, oh, he hit me in the throat. Jake. No, 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 no. Jake, 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 it's just a nerf dart. Okay, we don't have a med kit in this tank. Why didn't we have a make it? Ah, this is what it went right into my throat. Ah! Jake, this tank sucks! Good thing we got side turrets! No! Fire! Ah! Logan, we need to get a direct hit on him Jake, with that main This cannon. tank is not safe. It's very safe, Logan. I'll push him back with the turret. You use the tank cannon and blast him. How many more rounds do we have? Three. Okay, we can do this. We're locked and loaded. Go there. Oh, no. I got a jam. I got a jam. The turret's jam. My gun's jam. He's getting close. No, Logan, we need ammo. Jake, the cannon's jammed. No, 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 no. No. Oh, no. The cannon broke. Jake, the cannon broke. The cannon broke. I can't see Phil. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna manually reload this thing. Maybe I can shoot the cannon manually with this leaf blower. Oh! He's in the base! The pistol! Get out of the tank! We did not plan well for an intruder. Jake? Yes, Logan? We need to have a meeting. Uh, a little busy, Logan. Just had to manually reload this thing. We got Phil moving in on us. I think, I think we, we, did, we failed in terms of defense. He has so much ammo. He's mobile, he's able to move. We can't move in this tank. He was just in our base. I know, Logan, but what are we supposed to do? Guys, I think they're out of ammo. I think we accept the loss, Jake. We failed at building the tank. Logan, we didn't fail at building a tank. We built a great tank. We just didn't fill it with enough stuff. Oh my God! Show me the face again! Okay, okay, truce, retreating. Fail, I come in peace. I come in peace. There is a truce. You may have infiltrated our tank today. Guys, if you think we should keep upgrading the tank, maybe build another military vehicle and have it face off against the tank, comment down below and smack that like button. Let's try and crush 10,000 likes like they just got rolled over by a tank and leave your suggestions in the comments down below. Oh!